Uh, dropping in at the top here, there's a couple of little doubles. Um, quite a pedalling section from the start. Remember this little uphill rock garden, you got a pre-op so you don't get a puncture. Dropping down a triple step, flat out now into a berm. And um, this section is sort of, not flat, but you want to carry your speed, so there's a lot of pedalling and pumping. This is all a tailwind along here, pretty, pretty fast. And once you go over the edge, like, around here, that's when the wind sort of dies away and you can really get into the room. Um, a lot of these sort of slaty turns, the left handers all have nice berms, and the right's just a lot of that rock laid down, so when it had mud on it this morning, it was so greasy, but there again, a nice left hand berm, and then uh, into sort of tricky right hander, so it's, it doesn't flow amazingly, you know? really have to work it to keep your speed up, and uh, Danny's doing a good job here. It's really hard to carry your speed and you need to make sure the bra your braking's perfect and on these rocks it's, it's real slippery so you've got to be, it's like riding on eggshells, you know, so, uh, but no, you've just got to take each section at a time and a big berm, you've got to do your braking, make sure everything's perfect. Another big berm, you've just got to really link it all together. It's like, like poetry in motion if you're doing it correct. This is a pre-op here over the dip. Oh, Danny's just taking it on like a champ. Flat out down here, breaking hard into the right. Um, another really rough bit here. He's staying high. And they're getting near the bottom of the track now. Oh, he's getting getting creative with his lines. Staying tight here, hopping the rocks. A little bit of a pedal over the bridge. Um, and then there's a big hook for the spectators. You've got to do a little hop there and then get a couple of cranks in off the drop. I think that's been uh, taking a few people for a ride today. Little high line just here, setting up for the big corner. These corners are so important because when you're racing, if you, it's all about the exit speed. And if you don't carry good exit speed, then you may as well go home because it's uh, this one is very important. Up here now it's just an uphill climb, flat to the finish. This is where you'll see who's been doing their training. So, uh, Danny's carried good speed there, done an overtake and you're just cranking pretty much all the way along here. It's another little uphill, which is just, you know, fortunately it's the end of the run, so you can absolutely lay everything down. But um, yeah, it's going to be pretty physical come uh, race day. Little hop here onto a rough, natural section and slap this right hander. Pedaling across the road, bit of a jump from the finish line. Now to run down Antostiniog, first national, first BDS.